वेलकम बैक इन कैप्रिकॉन यू वॉचिंग सीक्रेट सन थारो लेट्स सी वट मैसेज कम थ्रू फी यू दिस वीक कैप्रिकॉन सन मून राइजिंग वीन इस एंड रिपटर रिवर्स द रोल्स इफ नीडेड स्विच द केसेज एज आई ऑलवेज से सी थारो रीडिंग्स आर जनरल दे कैन रेजनेट विद योर सिचुएशन इन पार्ट्स टू सिमटाइम्स Honestly, tarot readings are riddles. You know, you have to decode them, apply it on your situation. Especially when it comes to general readings, they are not very specific, right? Sometimes, when we get very specific messages, we mention in the reading that this is something really specific. So, if it's meant for you, you're just going to flow along with it, right? Don't don't force the reading on your situation. All right. Capricorn. Let's see what messages come through for you. While well, I was shuffling for you, King of Wands was there under the deck, and it's not going away. It's not going away, really. <laughs> so King of Wands can be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, or somebody who is uh, not really taking any action. Very attracted to you right now. I don't really see Knight of Cups in reversed. So that's why I felt it's not it's not moving because in the previous. I tried recording for you in the just before this too, right? Within few seconds, I I lost the reading. King of Wands was not coming out; it was just staying under the deck. So that means somebody is there, completely present in your surroundings, in your energies. But this person is not moving. They're not saying anything. They're not communicating specifically. When Knight of Cups is coming out in reverse. If you're expecting somebody to open up, make a confession, take a stand, tell you how they feel, they're not doing that. They're not doing that right now. Possibly, again, you know, you'll be like as you're repeating things, but you know, uh, Seven of Swords and King of Wands was there in that reading, and it's still there. For some of you, somebody is lying to you about their family situation, right? There's some terrible ending that has happened in their life. Just recently, or they're going through a a very severe type of moment in their life. Can be something surrounding long term stability, money, or finances. Something has really ended in their life, and that that is causing so much burden on their back. For some of you, they're experiencing an ending, and um, they are somehow. I see they were quite focused on that, and they were working over it, right? And uh, Financially, for a lot of you, I see this is coming up financially. So maybe they have experienced some bad, uh, terrible experience when it comes to their work life, money life. But somehow, long term stability is under. Uh, I'm sorry, is it, getting affected by that situation, whatever has happened, right? So for some of you, I feel there's a conversation impending. There's a there's a message of love. There's a confession of love, which is not. Moving right now, not coming towards you. It's there. It's stuck, right? It's there, but it's stuck. Somebody's not confessing the feelings they have. They're not admitting it. Moving forward, Capricorn. Let's see what is coming up for you. What's happening with you here? Queen of Wands. I see you. This can be you or somebody you're dealing with. Again, fire sign energy match is coming up here. Queen of Wands with the King of Wands. This is a couple very attracted to each other. You might be depicting. Um, I should say you might be in that uh, energy for some of you this week, like watching each other from a distance and looking at each other, having eye contacts, and there's a vibe that yes, I like you, I like you, and this communication issue I'm picking up, right? Somebody is not saying, okay, not saying or telling the other person how they're feeling, but the the fire is so much that you can't avoid each other. Again. You're very happy about this. It's like for some of you, Capricorn. This is you here. You you're appearing very happy and positive. You're vibrating beautifully outside, and you're telling people, "Oh, I'm happy. I'm single. I'm attractive. You know, I'm getting a lot of proposals." And you're actually getting that. I'm not saying that you're not, but you're actually getting that. But somewhere at heart, you are expecting a specific person to reach out to you or a specific person to come and talk to you. Right, you you're acting as if I don't really care. I have a lot of proposals. I'm very happy. I'm I'm like a catch right now, and that is true. But there's some kind of feeling within you which is a little uh, turning a little toxic right now. I'm picking up that there's an obsession or there's a there's a continuous thought on your mind. That why is it not coming in? Why this person is not speaking? You're silent. You're trying to know about it, but. I see this person is not doing anything right now, and you watching them from distance. They're watching you from a distance, but the conversation is not taking place. 
Yeah, Empress, but you know what? I don't really see you doing anything about it. King of Wands. It's not going away. I'm telling you, it's not going away. Queen of Cups here, right? You're emotional, but you're hiding your emotions. Or somebody is really in trouble right now because of a body sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, right? So uh, I'm getting here that you know your worth. You know, you, you're like, okay, I'm not going to... Um, how should I say that? It's like you want somebody to see you for what you are, right? Despite of the strong intensity, I don't really see that you're going to make the first move. You want this person to level up because you're the empress. And I really feel you're catching a lot of attention this week. You're getting a lot of attention. People are looking at you. You're beautiful. You're beautiful here. Queen of Pentacles. Here you are. For some of you, see a lot of lady energy, a lot of feminine, feminine energy here on the table. For some of you, you might be dealing with multiple people, right? For the rest of you, I see you are focusing on your growth now because this connection is right now enough moving forward and the confession is not taking place or things are not just <clears throat> things are under question right now i feel so you are more focused on building your empire your money your work pentacles for some of you this is um, a boss figure or somebody in your surroundings but i see you know it's like there's a vibe that okay i'm giving you signs i'm giving you signals this person is also doing the same thing but if you're not leveling up and coming to me i'm not saying anything right five of pentacles yeah within you there's a feeling of abandonment right and for some of you i see this can be other way other way around also this person is watching you looking at you but again you're keeping bold faces here this is not going away again you're, you're keeping bold faces here, but I feel you guys are really feeling that this connection is out in cold right now. This lack of communication, that this lack of uh, honest expression in this situation. Page of Cups. Now, somebody is going to come in and confess, but it's not as per what you're expecting. Somebody is getting ready to open up in this connection. Eventually, I see this is this person you're expecting, right? You're feeling really bad about it. You're acting as if you're very very cool nurturing your money and doing your work you're not really doing you're not really saying anything about it you're in a good place financially emotionally in fact financially and uh, i see <clears throat> when it comes to getting attention when it comes to getting proposals you're doing good really i see there are a lot of people queen of Wands is in is in is somebody who gets a lot of attention is very confident is some okay no siri Potentially, okay. I didn't get that. Could you try again? No. Okay, coming back to your reading. <clears throat> Queen of Wands is somebody who gets a lot of attention, and I think you are under a lot of attention this week, but this specific energy is right now out in code. I see eventually somebody is going to get uh get in that mode where they will be confessing their feelings where they will be coming up but somebody wants to tell you here that they are preparing a cup for you <clears throat> they're not coming in and honestly confessing the feelings you want to hear they're not exactly saying that right now they're going to reach out i do see conversation or communication over this week or some kind of expression i don't know how much communication is uh, active or i should say uh, what kind of con communication you both share because i see it's watching and looking and giving signs but not really moving forward you know it's like i'm getting a for honestly for a lot of you i'm getting a scenario of office life or work life romance you're looking at each other from distance and you are looking at them from your area and a lot of uh, watching watching is happening spying and you know attraction is there but again work and people there are a lot of females in your surroundings or a lot of people are there who are lo looking at you and you're not making the move feeling cold here this person is definitely going to give you some body language some signs that yes i, I do like you somebody wants to open up here but i think right now uh, one of you or maybe both of you are not in that state of completely opening up and telling the other person and committing you know it's not just about confession it's about getting into a commitment there's a truth surrounding money work right financial stability for some of you there's a job offer or there's a work opportunity or something which is promising and you're getting the truth about it 
I, I see you very dissatisfied or maybe it's this person who is very dissatisfied because they're expecting something solid right now it's i think it's on, on the process it's going to come in soon but right now it's not moving forward so ace of swords is showing me that some truth surrounding finances is uh, not letting this connection move forward for some of you this simply can be that work-life situation and you you guys can become part of uh, gossip and that you don't want or simply there are bosses here who are somehow having the eyes at you specifically one female boss possibly or a manager or somebody and you know that if this thing comes out this can really potentially um, hamper your official contacts or something like that i see somebody is not doing that because of that page of wands but eventually again can you see the wands here eventually i do see conversation for some of you if you're getting a message you might think of replying it this week but uh, again four of swords six of swords justice somebody's under pressure somebody's under pressure i see somebody's avoiding a contact or avoiding a conversation because um somebody's under pressure i feel strength yeah it's like even if you're getting the communication you are thinking about it whether i should reply to it or not strength is showing me at the end of this uh, reading that uh, temperance and the strength i see these these two energies are depicting you right now capricorn where you are stepping back to analyze are you really ready for the commitment or are you really ready for this kind of uh, situation to move forward because king and queen of wands they're not committed partners they are strongly attracted to each other. There's intensity between both of you. But right now, I don't really see. It's more like dating, fling energy right now, right? It's not a solid commitment. You want something solid on the other hand. But right now, I do see some opening up, some communication. Eventually, somebody is getting ready to open up a little bit. But Knight of Wands is showing me that it's not the way you, you, you're expecting right now. And Strength is the card where even you are... Uh, taking a step back holding the, holding back the urges to say anything because you need to think about this from scratch there's a loop here you know eight strength it's a loop energy here for the funds yeah eventually i do see there's going to be partnership right eventually four of wands is a new relationship new connection new partnership or simply just giving a chance to somebody so that things can get stable right four of wands is stability i do see eventually and we were talking about the loop see the struggle the cycle the continuous uh, movement i do see this person is going to reach out to you and they are eventually going to talk about something stable for some of you if you're already in a connection in your life right and that connection is not moving forward I see there are other people who are really interested, but right now you're not giving them a chance because there is this two cup, these two cups. Can you see that in these two cups? There is something under question right now. It's something under process right now. And for some of you, uh, because that connection is not moving forward, you don't want to give a chance to other people as of now because you don't know the status of that particular connection which is important to you that's something i also heard if you're already in a relationship with somebody <clears throat> right until the time it is not moving forward i see you stepping back and holding back the urges to date or you know respond to new proposals in your surroundings because there's something which is important and it's under question right now four of wands i do see eventually stability coming in so i don't know if this is with this, this person you having eyes at or it's with some very solid partnership of past or simply you're, you're opting out of something and looking for new connection in your life that's totally up to you but i do see things are stagnant right now right <clears throat> but eventually four of wands is coming in so that's 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 good that's important okay let's analyze a little bit further and then we're going to wind up the reading capricorn so what do you want to say king of wands this king of wands has been there in your reading it's not going away so what do you want to say king of wands malady okay somebody feels that the 
that the health of the connection is really deteriorating, right? Uh, somebody is irritated here because they feel, yeah, this person wants conversation, right? But the problem is for some of you, I'm strongly getting this vibe that somebody is concerned about the health of this connection. It's not moving forward. They're thinking about you. They're awake at night. They're thinking about you. They're feeling cold and abandoned the way you are. But somebody is afraid and very guarded against being the topic of gossip right it, this person is uh, really skeptical about being the part of gossip and i see they're, they're acting like a thief here they're acting like uh, somebody who is very secretive they want to hide your connection and passion the very strong message that we had in the beginning somebody is concerned about your connection becoming the topic of gossip amongst people right they don't want that and they want this connection to move forward they want to talk to you and they're really holding back their urges and i think you're doing the same because because of some reason there's a lot of influence i see a lot of feminine influence maybe girls group sitting and talking or they are concerned that what if they what if you tell this to your mother sister or female friends or something like that and they're going to gossip about it everywhere i see this person is really concerned about that and that's the reason why things are not moving forward at the pace you want right that's something i'm strongly getting here okay what capricorn needs to hear let's quickly have a message and then we're going to wind up the reading somebody's really uh, conflicted here because there's a new beginning waiting for you Capricorn, a new adventure awaits. Embrace it and live your dreams passionately. Four of Wands, a new beginning. This is showing me that there's a potential here, very strong potential if you want, provided the concern of this person is met. I see they are really wanting to open up, but they're afraid. What is going to happen if this this thing gets out and everybody gets to know about this connection? There's some reason for some of you maybe. There are common people in between, they're common friends, or maybe this is, for some of you, I also heard that uh, you are a friend of their ex or something like that. So, or maybe they are a friend of your ex or something like that, right? Deep in your heart, you already know the answer. Do what feels right. So despite of the, despite of the fact that things are little in limbo right now and uh, there's the cycle, which is really not uh, balanced i see in this this connection is imbalanced right now really you're being advised to do what feels right in the situation listen to your intuition even if the conversation is not coming in right now L listen to your intuition and i i see somebody needs to work on trust right somebody needs to work on the trust of this connection how much you both trust each other and i think that's the only way you guys can restore stability in this situation, right? So this is what I have for you. Capricorn, thank you so much guys for watching. Bye.